Send forth your spirit, spirit of power. Send forth your spirit, Holy Spirit, Lord our God. My dear brothers and sisters, Shalom. Pope Leo XIII wrote this in his encyclical, uh, Divinum Illud Munus, that many Christians have an excessive poor knowledge about the Holy Spirit. They mention his name in pious exercises, but their faith is no longer alive. They do not speak about the Holy Spirit. They do not know the, the, the gift of the Holy Spirit. Or if they know them, then they just know a few lines they learned at the catechism. If I can address this question individually to you, my brother, my sister, how many gifts of the Holy Spirit do you know? Today I want us to reflect about the Holy Spirit, the gift in our lives. The Holy Spirit, the gift in our lives. Today is the Pentecost Sunday. And this Sunday is well known as the Feast of the Holy Spirit. What does the word Pentecost mean? Actually, this means 50th. And it was the second of the three major feasts in the Jewish calendar. This Pentecost feast occurred seven weeks after the feast of the Passover. And for Christians, especially the Catholics, this feast occurs after the resurrection. And this feast for the Jews was primarily a feast of thanksgiving for the harvest. The first fruit was given to God on this specific day. And um, for Christians, this feast, the, 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 the Pentecost feast that we are celebrating today is uh, without uh, bringing in a lot of speculations, is about the Holy Spirit descending upon the disciples the Holy Spirit as a gift given to the disciples, the Holy Spirit as a gift given to Mother Mary who was with the disciples in the upper room. Today as we are celebrating the Pentecost day, the Holy Spirit is also coming to our lives as a gift. It means that my brother, my sister, if you open your heart to this Holy Spirit, if you accept that this Holy Spirit should enter your life, I tell you this Holy Spirit, the, what it did to the, the, the disciples of Jesus to enable them so that they may start uh, proclaiming the word of God without fear, this Holy Spirit is ready to transform your life. This Holy Spirit is ready to change the, your life and to change away all these corners of darkness. The Holy Spirit has come in your life as a gift. Just open your heart and receive it and you will find your life transformed and people will start seeing wonders in your life the way they saw wonders performed by the disciples of Jesus when they were speaking in tongues and everyone was listening to them and getting the meaning of what they were, uh, the meaning of what they were saying in their own mother tongues. Today is the gift of the Holy Spirit to us. My brother, my sister, open your life and receive the Holy Spirit. Send forth your spirit, spirit of power. Send forth your spirit, Holy Spirit, Lord our God.